Hello, welcome. <laughs> well, at least Dutch is a little bit easier. <laughs> but uh, but anyway, hello everyone and welcome to another coin hunt video. Uh, so I've got 100 euro here from my bank. Uh, that's 52 euro coins in two bags. And as always, just looking out for commemorative coins, uh, low minted years, low minted coins and um, yeah, just just coins from Germany with the different mint marks. But anyway, uh, let's get started. Hopefully we'll have something nice within 50 coins. It's uh, the most I can hope for. <laughs> but anyway, we start today with one from Germany. Uh, then the Netherlands. Oh, nice! It's a uh, it's from 2003. So anything anything from the Netherlands, and uh, basically if it's from before or if it's from before 2002 or 2002, it's not worth keeping there's a very very high mintage but anything after 2002 is a nice find um but yeah nice <laughs> 2003 from the netherlands <laughs> first find okay um and then we got the regular oh no wait, we already had already had a german coin sorry <laughs> uh we got one from france Oh cool, uh, we have a commemorative here from uh, Germany uh, for the city-state of Bremen. Nice. Midmark F, hopefully that's one I need. Um, oh, regular from Spain. Uh, the regular from Ireland. Um, we have another, another regular Dutch coin, but the regular old ones from 2001. But anyway, I'll leave it up. Oh, we have uh, Dante from Italy. Nice. Oh, uh, followed by a commemorative coin from Italy, and this is the 50th anniversary of the World Food Program, and was Italy's first commemorative coin. And it's a, a design I really like. <laughs> anyway, it's nice. Yeah, nice find. Very common, but uh, still, still a nice one to come across. And then we have the uh, regular from Belgium with King Albert, uh, the former king now, of course. And the last coin in that bag is from Ireland. All right, so not too not too bad for one bag, I have to admit. Got remarkable that coin from the Netherlands made it here to Ireland. There's not many to many of them to begin with in the Netherlands. All right. Um, I don't know. Will we have a have an old look at the edges again? Uh, seeing if I can, how much I can remember. Right, so let's see. Okay, we've won at the end. And I think it's the one from Germany. That's got, uh, I think it translates to something like uh, freedom and unity and justice. I don't know if that's the right order, but I'll have it below. But just to see if I'm right. Yeah, of course, it's from Germany. Uh, I think that one next to it, uh, it's another Germany, yeah. Uh, oh, I see another one, I see God, so I think that could be the Netherlands. That has God be with us in Dutch. Yeah, God Sieg, well, I don't know any Dutch <laughs> really, God Sieg met Oms, I think. But yeah, one from the Netherlands. But 2001 this time, so common. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, this one seems different. Uh, okay, so we got two euro, three stars, two euro. So this could be Austria. I think they do it that way. So let's see. Yeah, I'm right. <laughs> nice. I'm at least remembering the edges. 
Uh, anything else different? No, I think it's the standard, the, the number two and two stars repeated. But anyway, let's see. Yeah, Ireland's got that. Uh, Spain's got that kind of design on the edge. Uh, France has it. And yeah, then back to Ireland. Okay, we'll do the other, the other pile. Hopefully you guys like this, <laughs> me going through the the edges of the coins, but uh, I don't know, it kind of gives appreciation to to the edges, you know, they're different as well, country to country most of the time. Oh, okay, I don't think there's anything in this bit. I don't think, anyway. Oh no, sorry, <laughs> there's one, that's different. Uh... Su oh, Suami, Suami, we have Suami, Finland, of course, it's a bit obvious, yeah, of course, it's uh, one from Finland. It's nice that they have the name of the country along the edge of their coins. Uh, let's get back. Uh, I don't think there's anything different in that half, so I'll just set that aside for the minute. Uh, okay, there's one. And yeah, I think there's another, yeah, right, and yeah, it's another one from Germany. And then I think we have another one from Germany there. Let's see, yeah. Uh, <laughs> see one from Germany there anyway, so that's gone. Uh, oh, and then I think that's a German one at the end. And yeah, I think it's Germany, yeah. Right, so <laughs> we'll go through these coins and see see if there's any commemoratives amongst them. Anyway, uh, France, Ireland, France, Ireland, <laughs> Ireland. Uh, oh nice, it's uh, one from Italy. It's a commemorative coin uh, for Giuseppe Verdi. I think the 200th anniversary of his birth. That was released in 2013. So nice. Uh, okay, so Ireland, Ireland, France, Ireland, and we'll finish with one from Ireland. Okay, so uh, yeah, not too bad for a hundred euro. Uh, two two commemorative coins per bag, and you know, all right amount of countries. Uh, okay, so just move and zoom in. But anyway, uh, great to come across this one from the Netherlands. I will have to look up how many were made that year, but it could be a million. I'm not. I'm not too sure. But uh, a million is great. If it's anything less than a million, that's brilliant. And uh, yeah, of course, I'll have to check if I have this coin. And yeah, otherwise, nice. So I'll go and have a look about this coin. So we'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I've had a look in the book, and unfortunately, I do not need the Bremen coin with the F mint mark. But anyway, still still nice to come across it, but <laughs> not one I need. Now, in terms of my favourite coin of the coin hunt, um, it's going to be between these two. Um, I'd say this is a great find, um, but I don't know. <laughs> I'm kind of leaning towards a commemorative coin, maybe just the design, uh, because it's one I like. And if I did have to choose a commemorative coin I liked the most, it would be this. But that mean doesn't mean anything, because this was still still a great find. But anyway, uh, <laughs> that's that. Uh, that's another little 100 euro coin hunt done. So until the next coin hunt later in the week, uh, thank you for watching.